setting up dirty pot any quantity is okay add some onion skins eucalyptus leaves vinegar any vinegar works and any rustic iron this is rust water prepared soaking some iron rusted iron for three weeks then it looks like this and pour this into the soaked cotton cloth remove the excess water before soaking and then soak in this rust water for 40 seconds this is the second these are third and fourth steps after 40 seconds remove and squeeze the cellulose cloth here i'm taking the t-shirt and then spread it well and then arrange onion skins the only outer layer which is transparent so you can place it downward or upside face the way you like and here i added dollar eucalyptus leaves and you can just fold another fold and you can arrange some more skins and leaves so whatever you want you can arrange in that shape so here i'm doing on the sleeves too so that i get some pattern on the leaves and skin on the sleeves of this cellulose t-shirt and this arrange well and here i'm taking the iron rod which is very rustic this is rebar so i got it from hardware store so you can use whatever you have so just placing proper weight and then i'm just folding it very tightly as tight as possible so here i'm going to roll it whole thing so that it stays tight and firm and the print comes well so this is my first time of dyeing uh, with the cotton or cellulose t-shirt so before i had done other types like tie and dye all that but this kind of dirty pot method i'm doing it first time fourth step is rolling and fifth step is tying it tightly so here i'm using surgeon knot so we can use the old cotton t-shirt stir it into long strips and you can even join each other by small knot so these knots and the rope it looks very beautiful after coloring so you can use as many as you want uh, but it has to be very tight and just leave a little bit rope so that it is easier while pulling it up here i'm going to boil this for two and a half hours so it again depends on the type of leaves you have taken so onion skins and uh, eucalyptus works well for two and a half hours keep adding water so that the bundles remain submerged under the water boiling is sixth step here is the fun part untie or removing the rope this is seventh step and remove each and every leaf you can do this step immediately or you can keep for some time maybe few days then you can remove it but the important thing is every leaf should be removed
soda baking soda and water and so the printed cloth into this for at least 10 to 15 minutes so this should be done only for cotton ones after removing then you can wash them with other bundles you can do it by hand washing using light soap so here i'm using olive oil soaked in water a little bit and then made some solution and adding to the washing machine so this can be done with any light soap by hand or in washing machine i'm using here delicate molds and the last step this is very important you need to do immediately this is ironing the step 10 ironing that's it your printing is ready let me know in comment box how you like it and do try and share your pictures in the comment box thank you for watching